out to get the donuts this morning. You'll be high and dry here. No problems this morning. We don't have any rain just now, but look back to the west of us and that's what's coming in our direction. So eventually we are going to get into some rain here this afternoon. So let's time it out. Here's our WBTV Futurecast again. A lot of clouds already out there this morning, but no rain. Now most of the model guidance suggests that by 12 noon we're starting to see rain back across the upstate and the foothills and then that just overtakes the area. Initially it's very, very light, but as we get later into the afternoon there may in fact be some heavier downpours. So again, if you're kids got a soccer practice or a baseball game scheduled for this afternoon this evening. Maybe just that commute home. Yeah, I think you're just going to be impacted by rain. It's not looking all that great. Not going to be terribly heavy for most neighborhoods, but the rain is going to be with us right through the afternoon into the evening hours, only gradually uh, setting off as a little bit of drizzle during the overnight hours. We're mostly in the 40s though. Charlotte's at 52, 49 Matthews, 44 in Ballantyne, 49 in Tika K and 47 now around. Weddington and Indian Trail. Now, as we look at some other numbers, we're mostly in the upper 40s to low 50s right now. 50 Monroe, Lancaster, much cooler to the east of us, where again the clouds have last come in, so those clouds sort of act as a blanket, so they've been a little bit clearer most of the night. Salisbury right now at 39. 70 is a normal high. We're going to wind up there, but again, the rain chances will be going up as we go deeper into the afternoon, so you may not need the rain gear at all this morning, but you probably will if you're going to be outdoors this afternoon. It's all with this warm front coming northward. Now here's the payoff. On the other side of this warm front, we'll get rid of the clouds tomorrow morning and then a decent day tomorrow, especially for the afternoon and Wednesday. Very warm here before we get this front to move in with showers and thunderstorms later on Thursday. And unfortunately, it looks like another severe weather outbreak for the same areas that were hit on Friday. Looks like that's going to be the case tomorrow, so we're going to be monitoring that situation for them. 80 for tomorrow here, 84 on Wednesday, then 82 Thursday. Oh, it'll last into the holiday weekend, right? Not so fast. Good Friday, 63. Saturday only in the 50s, and we do have elevated rain chances starting Thursday afternoon with that front, and then the potential for a wedge developing here on Friday and Saturday with on and off rain and drizzle. So we will keep you posted on that. But today's first sort weather day back end loaded. You're fine this morning. Scattered showers this afternoon this evening. Low clouds in the morning tomorrow. Give way to sunshine 80, then 84. Here comes the frontal system, and then this becomes a little bit problematic going into Friday, Saturday, Sunday, especially with outdoor plans. All right, let's check in with Becca right now. See how the roads are doing out there for slow traffic.